The University of the Philippines Marine Science Institute or UPMSI projects that the oil slick from the sunken empty Princess Empress in Oriental Mindoro will continuously affect the coastal areas of Nauhan, Pola as well as in Kalapan. Last March 27, the Philippine Space Agency or PSA has discovered using a satellite image that there is a formation of oil slick more than 200 kilometers from the Verde Island. UPMSI earlier projected that the ocean current will drive parts of the oil slick to the Verde Island Passage or VIP. Experts still expect that it can reach as far as Batangas. There's a potential for parts of the slick to be carried to other areas of Oriental Medora as well as uh, Batangas. The National Disaster Risk Reduction and Management Council or NDRRMC reported that the damage in agriculture caused by the oil spill now reached 263 million pesos. There are also almost 17,000 farmers and fisher folks affected by the incident. The Bureau of Fisheries and Aquatic Resources or BIFAR recommended to continue the implementation of the fishing ban. The latest water quality assessment shows no assurance of food safety. So, this is mga araw na kinuha ito, ay hindi pa talaga nag-spread ng uh, ganun kalawak yung uh, ano, oil spill. Kung kaya uh, ganun yung nakita natin. At may possibility din na sa mga ganitong panahon na, na, na talaga nag-spread na yung oil spill, ay yung posibleng mataas na ito. Kaya ang inaanan natin is continuous monitor. Tapos makasiguro tayo na wala na talagang traces. BFAR will continue its monitoring and update the public on the water quality in the areas affected by oil spill. Ray Pelayo, UNTV News and Rescue, we serve the people, we give glory to God.